Hello YouTube, it is AJ Butch 123 here. I'm just bringing you guys a video on how to set up throttle stop for um, pretty much any Acer with a throttling problem out there. Um, this of course is my Acer 6 Aspire 6920G. Um, I just have something over the palm rest and keyboard right now, but um, this is the one that I've upgraded. It has the GeForce 9600M GT. It also has the uh, Core 2 Duo T9500 has a 2.6 gigahertz processor, and uh, it's a lot better for games like uh, Battlefield Bad Company 2 and everything that are processor intensive. Um, anyway, so I'm going to go over here to the, my other monitor, and uh, this is uh, this is Throttle Stop right here. The files for Throttle Stop, and I just have them in Documents. Um, as you can see right down there, I just unzipped it to Documents. So there we go. Um, what you're going to want to do is you want to create a shortcut of that right there. And you want to put that in your startup folder. And the startup folder should be in start under all programs. Um, and it should be right there. And as you can see I have a shortcut in there so it starts with Windows. Um, if you have another way to do it, if you want to you know, add a register key or something to for startup, um, go right ahead. It's just I'm lazy so I did it that way. Um, anyway, I think that pretty much covers that. Then uh, once you pull up throttle stop here, this is what you pretty much what you're gonna see. Um, you want to check the chipset clock mod box and uh, make sure that's a hundred percent and you want to click the set multiplier and make sure that's clicked all the way up to the top what it can be. Sometimes this right here would be checked that is super low frequency mode you want to uncheck that um, this right here is enhanced speed, te uh, speed step technology I believe um, you want to make sure that's checked uh, depending on what you're doing I mean it shouldn't shouldn't matter uh, if you guys know what that is and don't want to check it you know whatever um, and you also want to uncheck disable turbo if it is checked some processors it is grayed out because they can't support it anyway so um, if you can uncheck it that's probably why um, anyway af after that's all done you want to go in here to options and you want to click minimize on close and start minimized and, uh, and just click ok and then right here where it says turn off it's going to say turn on and I'll just go ahead and click it off for a second there that's off and then you just want to click turn on and you want to close it and that will show it anyway be right down here on the taskbar if you can see it right there but uh, anyway that's pretty much how you set it up so if you have any questions or, um, or anything like that just leave them in the comments below or private message me or something and I'll see what I can do for you anyway um, have a nice day hopefully this helped you um, thanks for watching